This area here is owned and being developed by Ergon Properties. And today, developers tell me they could be just weeks away from announcing what will be built here in the first phase of development. It's a 70-acre area in the midst of construction work, but developers with Ergon Properties are still guarded about the exact number of businesses that will be opening here and their names. It is in close proximity to the Brandon Amphitheater, and but one of the reasons business owners opened up a Moe's Pizza Hut combo just on the other side of the interstate. I saw a lot of development going on the other side as well, so car lots, restaurants, retail shops. So we wanted to get on this side. Restaurant Row is what we considered Chick-fil-A, Starbucks. We wanted to get over here as well, because we, we know a hotel's coming as well, so a lot of businesses being built in Brandon, Mississippi we want to be a part of that. Ergon Property says that first phase will include a strip-style center with a Mexican restaurant, a hotel, and a grocery store, for starters. Just, uh, it's booming. We haven't slowed. Even though interest rates have ticked up, uh, we still got homes going up here. Brandon Mayor Butch Lee says there are homes being built and the increased traffic flow that will follow the opening of the East Metro Parkway to Old Brandon Road in a few weeks' time. He says he knows residents are anxious to find out what is coming to that 70-acre area and that announcement is not far away. We will announce and tell those stories as those proprietors want to tell those stories. We'll stand beside them and say, this is what we've been working on uh, and be very happy that they're here in Brandon. And a lot of speculation that a Costco was coming here. Developers say that's not all the books here. This will be the first phase, though, of development of this area. Also, a lot of concern about when that East Metro Parkway extension is going to be open. According to the mayor, they should be cutting a ribbon there by the end of October. We're live in Brandon, Scott Simmons, 16, WAPT News.